Okay, hello everyone, welcome to day four of my 12 day or longer channeling challenge. Uh, today what I'd like to do is something that I um, haven't done very much of, but I'd like to ask a question and do a live channeling about that question. And my question is about the medicine that everyone has been taking uh, all over the world. Um, I've been reading many, many different accounts from many different people, from doctors. Uh, the news is saying one thing, and and the other, the alternative media is saying something different. I don't really know what's going to happen or what's happening. Um, I've been told that um, I can't really, the guides can't really tell the future per se. So, um, so I'm just asking to see what what their take is on on the medicine that people have been taking and what's going to happen or what might happen i guess so i'm calling in my guides good morning and everyone we are the hathors and we are here and we are very happy to be here in front of you to be able to discuss with you this amazing question, this wonderful question. This relates to what we talked about before, uh, yesterday, day three of our channeling. In day three, we we're talking about sickness and where sickness comes from. That sickness is an illusion. Unfortunately, right now on your planet, there are many people who have made a very specific choice. Now, all of you are spiritual beings. You are not your body. You are eternal beings. But there are certain decisions that you make that are irreversible. as a body. These decisions do not affect your soul, but they affect your body now on this planet. These decisions, this medicine, is in alignment with the ego on this planet. It's a choice. It was a choice point for all of you. The best way to look at it is as a story, as a movie. Think of your lives as movies. And in your movies, there are different choices that people make. And in these choices lead you onto a different future, a different path. And for your Earth at this moment, in this time, in this very, very important time on your Earth, it was important that everyone was given a choice point. And this, it was important that they were given the same choice. And by what they chose in that decision, that chose uh, their next step, their next path, what they needed to learn next. Our channel is very sad to hear this. But from our perspective, this is not a thing of sadness. This is a thing of, of great beauty. You are amazing storytellers. You created this beautiful story for yourself. What a wonderful story. How amazing is this movie for yourselves? You chose this point. And you chose this free will and this ability to choose um, one way or the other. And as we've said before, there's no judgment. There's no good or bad. This is, there's, this is a, a yin and yang universe. This is a night and day universe. There, you choose where you're going to go. And that's a beautiful thing. You have, you have a beautiful choice. So there is no wrong choice or right choice. You chose your choice. And that is your choice. And the choice that you chose, you knew for the most part. There is, we would say about an 80% uh, probability that you would have chosen what you chose. So you knew before you came what you would choose. So to your soul, it is as of no surprise. This was part of the experience. This is part of your experience. Okay. 
Okay, so that's, yeah, for me that sounds really sad. So, okay, next. Um, I guess I'll just ask one more question about the choice point. What, where did the choices lead? Um, taking and not taking. What, what are the choices? Hold on. Okay, so, um, yeah, okay, so that's my question. Where do these choices lead? Um, taking the medicine, not taking the medicine. We are the Hathors, and you know where both choices lead. All choices lead to the same place. They lead to love. That is the end result of all choices. You are here to have experiences on this planet, and that is it. And you are here to have this experience. So you choose one, you choose the other. In the end, it's love. It's all love. It all ends in love, because it all begins in love, and you are love. Okay, well, that's that's the answer that I got. Um, I'd like to actually find out more about this, and I hope this was kind of clear. Maybe it was a bit unclear. Um, I can't be very, um, I can't use certain words, um, but yeah, I think you get the drift. Yeah, so that's day four. Thank you very much, everyone. Cheers.